This is a five-way solenoid operated spring return valve. It's available in sizes from 1 8 BSP through to half inch BSP. These valves are designed to control a actuator, either a pneumatic actuator like a cylinder or a rotary actuator onto a butterfly or ball valve or another part of the process. This particular valve is available as a manual override on here. which can be pressed into turn like that and it can stay locked on if you require it or you can just take it back out and it pops back also has an LED indicator light, I'll just turn the unit on you can see the light coming up inside the indicator here and has also a surge suppression device as well in this particular connector plug to take out surge back to a PLC. The valve has the inlet port and two cylinder ports and the two exhaust ports which are reduced ports, 1 8 BSP. It can be mounted through these two holes here or it can be manifold mounted onto a base. We've got multiple manifolds and it goes through here and screws down onto a manifold. So you can have a series of these valves mounted together to operate different functions. The coil itself is rotatable through 90 degrees, locks in that position, or it can go right through to the other position of 90 degrees here. I'll connect this valve to the cylinder and demonstrate the operation. To function this valve, I'll just power it up. See so the LED light comes on when the actual valve operates. Now it has a manual override function so if I push that in and turn, it turns it on, turns it off. Now I don't have to actually rotate it to lock it on or to operate it, you just press and release. If you want to lock it on you press and rotate and then flick it back off when you're ready. To control the speed and the, the exhaust noise we can either put air silencers into the ports or in this particular case I'm putting exhaust speed controls. Once again with the valve operating By increasing this one here, we can change the speed to any, anything we want.